What's up, you guys? This is that Jack Dan back with another Every Marvel Legends video. This time we're talking about Every Age of Apocalypse X Men Marvel Legends. So, first off, in the Giant Man Toy Biz Build a Figure wave, we had a couple of Age of Apocalypse figures. We had the Weapon X Wolverine. This time he has his hair. Uh, he has a stub for a left hand. And then there was a variant that we got that you actually had to get in order to build the Giant Man. This had the more burnt face and the stub actually has some claws coming through it. So also in that same way, we had a saber tooth from the Age of Apocalypse. Next thing we see whenever Hasbro took over, we had the Nemesis build a figure wave. And of course, Nemesis or Holocaust is Apocalypse's son. So he is part of the Age of Apocalypse as well. Next, we had a Toy Fair fans choice winner. Age of Apocalypse Sunfire. This figure still to this day, in my opinion, stands up to time, test of time. Actually, in my opinion, with the flames on the legs and arms, it's kind of looks pretty amazing still. So this one was not released, but this was a Age of Apocalypse Jean Grey that we were supposed to get in the Rocket Raccoon wave. So looking at this compared to what we got with the Sugar Man wave that we're about to show you, I'm pretty happy with the Sugar Man wave. This one looks good too, though. So jumping over, we have the Caliban build a figure. Uh, we have Blink in that wave. Of course, Blink started off as Age of Apocalypse. So then a Sugar Man build a figure itself uh, is an entire wave of Age of Apocalypse. So here he is and all the figures you have to buy in order to build him. So here is that Jean Grey we finally did get. I'm happy with this one. Uh, it looks more like the comics version. Here is the other Sunfire we're getting compared to the original. Don't think it was needed. Weapon X, definitely an improvement over what we had with Toy Biz Days. So I'm glad we're getting this one. We got Dark Beast for the first time. This guy looks amazing. So happy with this one. We got X-Man, Nate Gray, or Nate Summers, whatever you want to call him. Wild Child with his chain. I really thought we was going to get a saber tooth since we got the chain, so hopefully Wave 2 will get another saber tooth. Morph. Definitely love this Morph figure. And we are definitely getting a deluxe, this is not a build figure, but a deluxe figure of Age of Apocalypse. Apocalypse. This guy looks amazing. So here are all of the Age of Apocalypse figures we've gotten so far loose. And here they all are in package. And here is a most wanted or a wish list of what I'd love to see for Age of Apocalypse. I'd love to see a Blob, Magneto, another Nemesis Holocaust, because that middle figure we had is definitely ready for an upgrade. Sabretooth, of course, needs an upgrade as well. Colossus, Cyclops, Kitty Pride, or Shadow Cat. Nightcrawler and Rogue. All need some love. Come on, Hasbro, let's get all these guys. So now I'm going to jump over and kind of talk about some of the horsemen that we um, have been made over the years and what we could see in the future. So, first off, back in the Hulk Classics, we had the War Horseman. As Hulk. In X Men Classics Series 1, of course, we have Archangel, and he's one of the horsemen as well. And then in, there's another form of that same Archangel, We've got a different paint scheme on him released later on. Another Archangel we got was in the Hit Monkey Wave. And then we got another one as a GameStop exclusive with an extra claw for the Apocalypse Builder figure that we had. And of course, this one actually has multiple heads. So you can actually build it with the Death Head. Also, another horseman is Caliban. Caliban was a Builder figure, so we got him as well. So here are all of the horsemen we've had so far built as Marvel Legends. 
technically there's only three, if you look at it this way. Here they all are in package. And here is a wish list or most wanted list for what I'd love to see for Horsemen and as for Marvel Legends, I'd love to see Polaris as Pestilence. Gambit as Death. Wolverine as Death. Psylocke as Death. And Deathbird as War. And just so you guys don't think I forgot anybody, we also have Colossus as War. Uh, he took Man, takes, Man Thing's place as War. Deadpool. Moon Knight as a female. The Venom symbiote. This was all in the Apocalypse War storyline. And we also, as Death, had all four of these, Dakin, Sentry, Grim Reaper, and Banshee. Do I really think any of these need to be made? It wouldn't be bad, but uh, we'll see. Let me know what you guys think about that. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave any kind of comments. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that thumbs up, and I will talk to you guys later. And guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.